big moment. This is us going to California. Ooh. How cool is that? We're just gonna focus a bit before we fall. Oh my there's god! No sign here. <laughs> We're going. What? There's no sign. Okay, see a sign. Great. I guess because it's the road. maybe on the road, because it's such a small crossing here, literally some tiny ass bridge over the Colorado River. We're in California. <laughs> that is so cool. Yes. And no sign. <laughs> We just reached another big goal, 10,000 kilometers. In wow. the middle of nowhere. Yeah, <laughs> in California. Yeah. Awesome. Just in California. Actually, we thought we might get it right on the border yeah. to California, but no. That really. didn't work out. Yeah. I had almost forgotten how exhausting cycling in the heat can be. It's uh, about 30 degrees Celsius right now sun is burning down and we've finished almost all our water in this one morning um, yeah so summer is back <laughs> This is just crazy. Just this random massive dune in the middle of uh, Southern California. <laughs> yeah, really crazy. Wow, what a landscape. It's so cool. so funny we're just like 10 15 kilometers behind the dune and here all these fields are being artificially uh, watered and there's birds on the fields and it just the air is so much colder here as well because of all the water and it just feels like you're in a completely different climate zone coming from like the Sahara to I don't know pushing through to San Diego now. We want to arrive there tomorrow afternoon. That means two more days of uh, cycling about 100 kilometers. And we have to climb a pass that's about 1,400 meters high. Um, and there's this, this is meant to be a snowstorm or something coming on Friday. So we kind of have to um, yeah, reach San Diego tomorrow because we're a bit fr afraid that we might be stuck otherwise and that would be a problem because we have to leave the US on Sunday because of my um, Esther, my 90 days, they're over then. <laughs> the mountains right now it's actually the first time we're seeing naturally green grass <laughs> it's been a long time since we saw that in the US um, and this will actually be our last night camping in the US because tomorrow when we're in San Diego uh, we're gonna have a host for three nights and then 
We're crossing to Mexico. So I just saw the sign on the side of the road and I had to turn around and film it. <laughs> oh man. Today is the big day. It's our last full proper cycling day in the USA. And today we're gonna reach the coast and we'll have crossed the USA once with a bicycle. That's nuts. <laughs> That's cool. Wow. down now and it will go down most of the time now as we're going to San Diego which is by the ocean so yeah we're very excited um, to see the ocean again and um, yeah we're just wondering when when exactly we'll see it today <laughs> Getting closer to a big city, the traffic is getting more and more. But right now we have a good shoulder at least. The road into San Diego definitely isn't flat. So we have literally spent the better part of two hours either waiting at stop signs or slowing down for stop signs and it's just really, we really forgot how tedious it is to cycle into a city. Oh, of course it just turned green. Alright, this is it. We're at the ocean! At the Pacific! Wow! Can you believe it? We made it! Sounds like it's cold water. Well, that's it. We did it! We crossed the USA. <laughs> bye bye. Climbing the last hills for today because we're going to our host Steven now where we will be for three nights before we then go to Mexico and these hills in San Diego are a bit antisocial <laughs> rain has stopped and we're gonna explore San Diego a bit today. Right now we're on our way to Balboa Park. Yeah. And later uh, Steven wants to uh, show us a bit around. Yeah. yeah, should be cool. We're 
at an Afghan restaurant. Yeah, I do like mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You, you walked under the hill crest last night. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Fine, yeah, San Diego. Here we are. Is it bank or something? F three fifty tour drives with Toby, Louisa, and Steven. Heading to Sunset Cliff. leaving Steven's place he's uh, accompanying us to the border and then we're crossing to Mexico it's uh, crazy and exciting I'm a bit nervous <laughs> we've been in the US so long now and uh, you hear many good things about Mexico but also many bad things <laughs> so yeah it's gonna be a very interesting and hopefully very great experience for us. Sure. It's been well, really it was great to meet you. Very great Thank to you meet for hosting you us. It's been really awesome to have you. Thank you. Thank you for hosting us and for, uh, very welcome. for showing us San Diego. Turns out we can't cross the border where we wanted to. <laughs> um, we didn't film it there because it was right at the border, but there was this small uh, metal gate, and maybe my bike would fit through. Um, but Toby's bike with the guitar rack is just too long for that. Um, and the only road here is the interstate, and we were told. We can't do that, we would get in trouble and yeah, we're not risking that. So we have to drive a cycle another 15 kilometers now to the Otay Mesa border, which is a normal street and there we can go through. Um, it's not that far, but it's just very annoying. We've been in the US now for so long and suddenly we're in a different country again and it's a totally different country. It's new for the both of us. We've never been to Mexico and ah, we're really looking forward to the next weeks. <laughs> 